Welcome back to class student. Today we want to look at um, the YEG June 2008 biology objective pass question. Okay, so let's let's start. Let's learn something. Number one question here is in the binomial system of naming organism, the second name is called the I told you about the binomial naming of organism. Alright, A we have the what scientific name. B we have the common name c generic name d scientific uh, specific name all right so the answer to that is d specific name the binomial system of naming mixes of the word genus name all right generic name and the words and the specific name all right number two which of the following features does not necessarily place <coughs> paramecium at the higher level of organization over amoeba all right a presence of cilia b Absence of pseudopodia, C. Presence of micro and mega nuclei, D. Presence of more than one food vacuole, D. Presence of more than one food vacuole is the answer. It does not necessarily place um, amoeba, uh, paramecium over amoeba, right? Absence of pseudopodia places it, presence of micro and mega nucleus places it, and presence of cilia places it over, but this one does not place over. Amoeba, right? The living material of the cell consists of A, nucleus and cytoplasm, B, cytoplasm and vacuole, C, cytoplasm and cell membrane, D, nucleus and cell membrane, right? The living material of the cell consists of the what? The nucleus and the what? The cytoplasm, right? So number four, we see that use the information below to answer question four and five. A poopy accidentally watered a potted plant with what concentrated salt solution after some time the plant that um, began to wilt all right number four the wilting of the plant is due to the fact that a the root hairs die off and can no longer absorb water b the salt solution causes faster rate of transpiration leading to the death of the plant c the salt solution will cause water to be lost from the plant cell leading to loss of togo Indeed, plant tissue has been poisoned by the salt, which is, which is absorbed by the plant. All right, the answer is C. The salt solution what, uh, may cause water to be lost from the what, from the plant cells. All right, if we have observed, you know that salt is um something that uh, it absorbs or uh, uh, it absorbs water. If you put your normal salt outside, it what absorb water and turn to what water before you do it. All right, so it can what absorb water. Uh, it can absorb water and make the water to be lost from the plant cells. All right, so number five, which of the following activities will revive the plant? A, recovering the plant with dark paper to prevent further water loss from its surface. B, leaving the plant to adapt to the condition. C, exposing the plant to high concentration of oxygen. D, adding more water. All right, when you add more water, it will what? neutralize the effect of the salt. All right, so that is the answer D. Number six, primary growth in plant is brought about by the activity of the what? A, meristem, B, endodermis, C, epidermis, D, mes mesophyll. All right, it's brought about by the what? The meristem. All right, number seven, study the diagram below and use it to answer question seven and eight. Question seven, to form the ball and socket joint, the structure label I fits into another structure in the scapula called the A, the blade, B the glenoid cavity, C the olecranon fossa, D the word patella. The answer is the glenoid cavity. You can try to check um the skeleton to see that. All right, the structure labeled II is called A the deltoid ridge, B the trochanter, C the shaft, and D the trochlea. All right, the answer is the trochanter. Trochanter. Tr All right. Number nine. Number nine. Oh, number eight. Sorry. The answer is um, C. All right. The answer is C. The shaft. All right. It's the shaft. Sorry. Number nine. Which of the following part of the skeleton does not have a protective function? Which of the following part of the skeleton does not have a protective function? A. The ribs. B. The carpals. C. The skull. D, the pelvis, all right? The skull actually protects um, the brain. The ribs protect some internal organs. 
So the answer to that is the what is the what the cup house. All right, you know where your cup house are, your hand, right? Before the phalanges, before your fingers, right? It's called the cup house, metal cup house, and the phalanges or the digits. All right, number 10 carbon dioxide is carried in the plasma A in combination with homoglobin, B in combination with antibodies, C by capillary action, D as by carbonate ion. The answer is A in combination with what? Hemoglobin. Number 11, in the adult frog, gaseous exchange takes place through the A, the buccal cavity, skin and lungs, B, the buccal cavity, skin and spiracles, C, the gill, skin and buccal cavity, D, tympanic membrane lungs and gills. Alright, it takes place through the, or the buccal cavity, that is through the mouth, the skin and the what, and the lungs, alright? It is in the third pole. That uses gills, buccal cavity, and the water, the skin. All right. Number twelve. The process of regulating the amount of water and solute in the body fluid is called a osmosis, b diffusion, c osmoregulation, d homeostasis. The answer is what osmoregulation. Regulating the amount of water and solute in the body fluid is called osmoregulation. All right. Number thirteen. The presence of glucose in the urine of a patient is an indication. Of the malfunction of the A, the pancreas, B, the gallbladder, C, the liver, D, the spleen. All right, is an indication of the malfunction of the pancreas. All right, which does not release um the hormone insulin. All right, all right. So the hormone insulin that converts uh, the glucose to glycogen for storage, and it is secreted by the pancreas. But if it is not secreted, such person will be what urinating. A sugary urine, all right, urine that contains glucose. Number number fourteen. Each of the following statement is not true about hormones. Hormones are a a hormones are manufactured in ductless gland and poured straight and poured straight into the bloodstream. B hormones are carried by blood plasma to the required target organ. C hormones are Hormones are hormone responses are usually swift, instant, and electrical. Right? The answer is A. Right? Hormones are manufactured in dustless gland and pour straight into the bloodstream. Right? Which carries them to where they act. Number 15. Which of the following action? Which of the following action is not a function of adrenaline? It increases a blood body blood sugar by conversion of liver glycogen into glucose. No. B muscular power and resistant fatigue. C rate of heart beat, not eat. Rate of heart beat, sorry, that's a mistake. D dilation of pupil of the eye. Alright, so the answer to that is B. Alright, it's not a function of adrenaline. Alright, muscular power resistance to fatigue. Okay, number 15. Okay, does not. Uh, has to do with muscular power and resistance of fatigue. Number 16, plant hormones include the following except A, insulin, B, auxin, C, cytokinin, D, gibberellin. Right, the answer is insulin. Insulin is an animal hormone. All right, number 17, the passage of nerve impulses across the synapse is facilitated by secretion of A, acetylcholine, B, tyroxine, C, insulin, D, progesterone. All right, the answer is A, acetylcholine. All right, number 18. Number 18, the part of the brain which coordinates and controls body posture is the A, the cerebellum, B, the hypothalamus, C, the medulla oblongata, D, the pons viroli. All right, the answer to that is the word cerebellum, it's A. Okay, number 19, which of the following process is not a is not an example of reflex action blinking of the eye b reading c beating of the heart d sneezing all right reading is not a reflex action others are reflex actions all right number 20 number 20 number 20 the question to that is the eyes can properly focus image of objects on various distances on the retina by the process called a refraction b reflection C accommodation, D correction. The answer is what accommodation. It accommodates images on the what 
retina. Alright, which of the following sensations will not be detected by the skin? A touch, B pressure, C stress, D pain. Number 21, the answer to that is what? Stress, right? Number 22, the process by which flowers produce fruit without the process of fertilization is no, it's called A viviparity, B partenocopy, C propagation, D metamorphosis. The answer is what partenocopy, all right? That's a term used for plants that do not um, undergo sexual reproduction before producing fruit. Example is um. Your pineapple, alright, they do not flower, alright. Number 23, the part of the young root which pushes it way through the soil is the what? The part of the young root which that pushes its way through the soil is called A root A, B top root, C root cap, D lateral root. Number 23, the answer to that is the what? Is the root cap, alright, that's the part of the root that pushes its way. Through the what? Through the soil. Number 24. An example of a dehiscent fruit is A. Crotalaria, B. Tomato, C. Mango, D. Orange. Alright, number 24. An example of dehiscent fruit is what? Crotalaria. Dehiscent fruit are fruit that open, that open their pods to show the seeds. Right, things like um, mm, uh, things like beans. All right, the aspects. All right, which of the following 25 which of the following food substances gives the least amount of calories? A rice, B granite, C cabbage, D egg yolk. All right, number 25. The answer to that is what cabbage. It gives least amount of what calorie. That is energy. Number 26. Number 26. Analysis of the gut content of an animal show that it, con it contains small pieces of bones, seed, roughage, and insect. The animal is likely to be an A. Carnivore, B. Herbivore, C. Insectivore, D. Omnivore. Right? The answer is D. Since it, contained, it contains both plants and animal, it contains um, roughages, insect, bones. Right? So the animal is an animal that feeds on both on um, plants and animals. It could be man or pig. Alright. Number 27. Filament of spirogyra placed in a beaker of tap water in a dark cover diet. Because filament of spirogyra placed in a beaker of tap water in a dark cover diet. Because A. The filament. A. The filament could not photosynthesize. B. Conjugation could not take place. C. The temperature was too high. D. The plant was overflowed. The answer is A. Right? The filament could not photosynthesize. Number 28. The importance of the concentration of chloroplast in the palisade layer of the leaf is for maximum exposure to A. Carbon dioxide B. Light C. Water D. Oxygen All right? The importance of the concentration of chloroplast in the palisade layer of the leaf is for maximum exposure to what? Is to maximum exposure to what? Sunlight. When you are talking about the chloroplast, it contains what? The chlorophyll. Which has to do with what? Um, absorption of what? Sunlight. Okay. Number 29. A community is best defined as A. Living things in a habitat. It's not habitant. It's habitat. Right? A community is best defined as A. Living things in a habitat interacting with the non living part of the environment. B. Total number of individuals of one species of organism living in a particular habitat. C. C population of different species living together and interacting with each other in one habitat is habitat, not habitat. Sorry, the individual of a particular group living together in an area and sharing same resources. All right, number 29, the answer is C. All right, populations of different species living together and interacting with each other in one habitat. Number 30, which of the following physical factor is likely to affect the distribution of plants? In a pond, a light, b humidity, c wind, d temperature. All right, it will do what light, all right, because they need light to carry out photosynthesis. 
Right, so the answer is what he likes. Number 31. Which of the following instrument I used to measure wind speed? Alright, A thermometer, B barometer, C hygrometer, D anemometer. Alright, anemometer is used to measure wind speed, thermometer is used to measure temperature, barometer is used to measure uh, pressure, while hygrometer is used for measuring what water uh, moisture, right, in the air. Alright, so study the they said study the study the food web below and use it to answer questions that two and that three. Right, tertiary consumer within the web, tertiary consumer within the web are A, cat and lion only, cat and lion only, B, man and lion only, C, man and cat only, D, man, cat and lion. Right, the answer is what? Man and lion only. Right, man and lion are the only tertiary consumers here because grasshopper will feed on grass and um. Lizard will feed on it, then cats will feed on will feed on um, the lizard and man, alright? But the tertiary consumer here is what the man and the what and the lion. Alright, number three, what will be the effect of taking the lion out of the food web? What will be, be the effect of taking the lion out of the food web? Sorry, number thirty two is D. The answer is D, sorry. Is the man, cat, and lion are tertiary consumers, right? Because um, this is the primary consumer, this is the secondary consumer, this is the tertiary consumer, right? If you turn this to a food chain, you see that the cat is a tertiary consumer. I'm very sorry about that. Or be the effect of taking the lion out of the food web. Number thirty-three. A. The number of organisms at each trophic level would increase. B. Man would be would occupy the apex of the web. C. There would be more rabbits in the well, the, the energy reaching the remaining tropic level would increase. All right, the answer to that is what is B. Man will be at the apex, right? Will be at the apex of the web. All right, which of the following statements about the transfer of energy in an ecosystem is correct? All right, A. Energy increases at higher tropic level. B. More organisms can be supported at higher levels. C. There are fewer, fewer organisms at lower tropic levels. D energy is lost at each tropic level. That's the answer. Energy is lost at each tropic level. Number thirty-five. Food pond uh, pond weeds pond weeds normally lack thick layers of corticles because pond weeds normally lack thick layers of corticles because a their system of resistance is not efficient. B there is no danger of becoming desiccated. C their leaves are either dissected or ribbon shaped. D they are numerous stomata on their upper epidermis right so the answer is b there's no danger of them become desiccated that is of because of them um, going dry right that's why they don't have to resolve um uh, reserve water right those that have tico tico are those are able to reserve water they don't want to lose water to transpiration but since this one is living on water even when it's losing water it's gaining it back right number 36 Shrubs do not survive on new weathered soil because shrubs do not survive on new weathered soil because a the top soil is shallow, b drainage on such soil is poor, c humus is is absent from the soil, d the soil is tend to be sandy. All right, the answer is humus is absent from the soil. Okay, number thirty-seven. Number thirty-seven. The speed of the flow of water in a river is faster in the middle than along the banks due to a difference in turbidity at each part of the river b the abundance of fish in the fishes and other organisms along the banks c reduce force gravity in the middle portion of the bank d resistance offered by the wall of the bank all right d as a result of the word resistance offered by the walls of the bank but that's it the effect of environment degradation caused by human activities can be controlled by the following measures except a reclaiming the land b converting mining pits into fishing ponds c resetting indigenous inhabitant d educating people so let's read the question again the effect of environment degradation caused by human can be controlled by the following measures except all right the answer is d 
right? Except converting mining pits into ponds. You can reclaim the land, you can research the indigenous inhabitants, and you can educate the people, all right? Except converting mining pits into ponds. Number 39, the following observations concerned succession are true, except A, pioneer community has fewer species. That's true. B, middle stages community are most diverse, right? C, climate community has the greatest number of species. Climate community has the greatest number of species. D, total biomass of the community increases succession progress. All right, so the answer to that is C, climate community has the greatest has the greatest um, number of species. Number 40. If a person is introduced to a protein body to A. Destroy or disease causing organism in the body. B. Stimulate the body to produce antibodies. C. Enhance the production of red blood cells. D. Isolate disease causing pathogen from the blood. Alright, so the answer to that is B. To stimulate the body to produce what? Antibodies. Alright. Number 41. Which of the following activities constitutes biological control? A. A small bony fish transported on the back of a shark. Alright. B. Adding manure to crops in a garden. C. Tilapia feeding on lava and pupa of mosquito. D. A vulture feeding on the what, carcass of a goat. Alright. The answer to that is C. Using biological control is using a natural enemies right so you know tilapia feeds on the to control a particular pest right so tilapia feeds on a lava or what mosquito so many diseases 42 many diseases caused by bacteria can be treated and cured using a antiseptic b antibiotics c antigen uh d antibodies all right it can be treated using what all we know as what antibiotics all right number 43 to avoid overfishing in lakes, the following measures may be helpful except A. Limiting limiting fishing period. Sorry, number 43. Limiting fishing period. B. Regulating the size of the net. C. Uh, fishing throughout the year. D. Fish breeding exercise. Alright, the answer is C. Except C. Fishing throughout the year. When you continue fishing throughout the year, the fish will deplete, it will reduce the number. Conservation will be protected by A. Encouraging tree planting, B. Systematic deforestation, B. Overgrazing of fascia, D. Unbeated bush bunny, A. Encouraging tree planting. Number 45. Which of the following substance is not recycled in an ecosystem? A. Carbon, B. Energy, C. Water, D. Nitrogen. Number 45. The answer is what? Energy. Energy is not recycled in the what? In an ecosystem. Number 46. Which of the following statements about phenyl carbamide, right? PTC, is not correct. Some people find the taste of PTC to be bitter. B. Others find the substance to be tasteless. C. Ability to taste this chemical is irritable. D. Ability to, take, to taste this chemical is not irritable. The answer is D. Right, it is actually bitter to some people and it is not bitter to some people. While some are able to taste it, right, and it's irritable. All right, number 47. Which of the following character is not an example of discontinuous variation? Skin color, A, skin color, B, fingerprints, C, ability to roll the tongue, all right, D, sex type. All right, number 47. The answer to that is what? Skin color, all right, is a discontinuous variation. It's actually a what? Continuous variation, all right? Okay, so um, number 48, number 48, which of the following normal traits in a class of school children, school children may give an approximate, may give an approximate normal distribution curve when the variation is plotted? A, blood group, B, year shape, C, sex distribution, while D is what? Height. Alright, the answer is what? D. Height of the student to give what? A distribution, normal distribution curve. Number 49, the observable 
but as that is of an individual usually resulting from the interaction between the gene composition of it and the environment you refer to as what a allele b genotype c phenotype d chromosome right so the observable characters characteristics of an individual usually resulting from the interaction between the gene and the environment right is referred to usually resulting from the interaction between the gene composition and the environment is referred to as what sorry give me a minute right it referred to as c phenotype right right your gene and your environment makes up what your phenotype okay so the number 50 the sudden change in a gene structure or chromosome number in an organism is likely to be caused by an inheritable change in the phenotype is known as a migration b mutation c mitosis d meiosis all right it's called what mutation a change in what genetic or in the gene all right number 51 the effective cells involved in sickle cell anemia cell are a a a phagocyte a phagocyte a phagocyte b lymphocyte c erythrocyte d thrombocyte all right when you have sickle cell is a result of what lack of the red blood cell also known as what the erythrocyte all right so number 52 which one which what does the chemical composition of the generic material of all living organisms consist of a deoxyribonucleic acid b adenos, adenosine diphosphate c adenosine triphosphate d follicle stimulating hormone the answer is deoxyribonucleic acid right dna right that's deoxyribonucleic nucleic acid right which of the following occurrence is not a feature of meiosis a formation of four haploid cell b two successive nuclear cell division c pairing of homologous chromosome at prophase d formation of two diploid cells right the answer is d he said except formation of two diploid cells is the what is the answer it's not part of the characteristics of what meiosis all right number 54 which of the following diseases is commonly observed in human males and is set linked that is it can be carried from um can be transferred from the is linked to the cell or uh, to the to the sex that is male or female right it is more prone to one sex all right so um a very very B Down syndrome, Down syndrome, C sickle cell anemia, D color blindness. Right, it's color blindness. Okay, it is what sex link it can transfer to the child. All right, number fifty-five. Number fifty-five. If red is dominant to white and homozygous red P are crossed with homozygous white P plant, the first filial generation we have. All right, so if red is dominant to white and homozygous Red pea plants. When is something is homozygous, right? Let's say, right, homozygous red pea plant across with homozygous white pea plant, right? I said red is dominant to white. Okay, let's use this one as red. Homozygous um is dominant to white. This is the homozygous dominant. Why this is what homozygous recessive, right? So we have A A. We have A A A A and what A A. Alright, so if red is dominant to white and homozygous red pea plant across with homozygous white pea plant, the first filial generation we have two red flowers and two white flowers. B four red flowers. C four white flowers. D four pink flowers. Alright, the answer would be what would be B. We'll be having four red flowers. Alright, since we're having A A. Alright, so that means uh, A is what red, white, this one is the what white. And they said uh, the red is dominant. So this one will dominate over this one. Alright, so that means we'll be having four reds. Number 56, the resemblance of a part of a palatable insect to a poisonous insect is an example of a chemical deterrent to a predator. Alright, B an escape from the predator by camouflage. C an escape from the predator by mimicry. D a defense against predator by warning coloration, right? That's a 
and escape from predator by mimicry right by making uh, another number 57 which of the following statement is not true of the worker termites a to build and repair the nest okay b produce enzyme to digest cellulose c c search for food to feed the colony d look after the limb the answer is b they don't produce enzyme to digest cellulose what they do is they plant um, fungi which break down the cellulose right in the trees which of the following occurrence cannot be taken as direct observation of natural selection in recent times which of the following occurrence cannot be taken as direct observation of natural selection in recent times industrial melanism that's a industrial melanism b okay industrial melanism in mold b selective breeding in cattle selective breeding in cattle c insecticide resistant to some of mos some mosquito d development of long neck in giraffe all right the question which of the following occurrence cannot be taken as direct observation of natural selection all right so selective breeding of cattle is not natural selection that's an artificial selection by the farmer all right number 59 the accepted concept for the theory of natural selection does not include a tendency for an organism to overproduce right b struggle for existence c survival of the fittest c use and disuse of parts right the answer is a tendency for an organism to overproduce is not part of the right the accepted concept for theory of natural selection number 60 the order of evolutionary trend in plant is a bryophyta talophyta teridophyta and spermatophyta b talophyta bryophyta Teridophyta and spermatophyta, C. Spermatophyta, teridophyta, bryophyta, and talophyta, D. Bryophyta, teridophyta, spermatophyta, and talophyta. The answer is B. Alright, you can check that up in classification of plants. Talophyta, bryophyta, teridophyta, and what? Spermatophyta. Thank you very much. With that, we've come to the end of the objective part of this class. Okay, we'll meet in the theoretical aspects. Bye for now.